All right, guys, welcome back to yet another episode of Dragon Quest XI, the best RPG to hit this shore on the PS4 this year. I don't know, there's so many RPGs. I'm not going to be saying which one's better than the other one. There's a lot of good games you could be playing right now. Dragon Quest XI is one of them. But anyway, welcome back to another episode. And we are here to be on our way to Gondula. And this is one dude we should talk to. Off camera, I will go ahead and say I did make a couple of things off camera. Off camera, off camera, off camera. Anyway, the only thing we did was make some new armor for Eric. He now has a fur poncho. His defense is actually not Chuck E. Cheese bad. And what we want to do here is go ahead and show off some other stuff I made. I made something else. I know I made something else. What did I make? I made a staff for Veronica. Yes. Look at this, it's plus three. Magical Might goes all the way up. Magical Mending too, she doesn't really need it, but attack goes up. She's getting a lot of benefits from equipping this new staff, so we're gonna give it to her, damn. And on top of that, I think we can use this staff to use Fireball, so we don't need to waste MP with Fireballs. We can just go into our item slot and use it as a magic item. All right, so what I really wanna check really quick is Info, we're gonna look at our defeated monsters. We're gonna go by nearby monsters. Rushless armor. Iron armor and an iron broadsword. We might be able to steal this. The iron broadsword might be better than whatever I have right now for swords for soul. Like the bronze sword. Actually, I already have an iron broadsword. I didn't even realize it. All right, what else am I hoarding that I don't know that could be upgraded right now? All right, let me just auto equip cast iron claymore. Apparently that's the strongest weapon I can have, but I like this short, the sword and the shield. Kind of like that more. Even though it probably will get outclassed later, I kind of like it, I like having that extra defense. Um, Veronica, thorn whip, nah. Trickster, I might give that to Eric real talk. We also made Oh yeah, we got this assassin stuff. Critical rate left hand, 0%. Oh, this is for the left hand. So the left hand normally couldn't get criticals, but if we equip assassin, it can. Oh no, left hand means for his main hand. Okay. Never mind, I see. The gold bracer is actually better than the gold chain. The gold ring probably gets outclassed by something else, too. So let's go ahead and give him the gold bracer. Gives him more defense, more charm. Maximum HP goes down a little bit. I think that'll be worth it. She can get the bronze. Okay, scale armor for Silvando. Silvando's sword is outclassed immediately by a bronze sword. Charm goes down by a little bit. We're gonna give him our old scale armor. God damn. Your defense is kind of whack, bro. <laughs> you need a lot. I don't have any shields for this, man. All right, so we probably wanna go ahead. You know what? Let's try to steal something from these guys. Stealing sucks. It sucks! This is the worst thievery, the worst thieving in all of history right now. Barium, please. What's yours is mine! There we go. Iron broadsword, I got it. So now we can go in on this guy. Bruh, you blocking my fireballs, bro? Oh yeah, you're going to sleep. Alright, we're just going to straight up kill this guy. Don't 
Quarry, I'm here to we help. got it. We finally got what we wanted. Was it? His agility is back, but guess what? It don't matter. Bro, you've got to be kidding me on that. <laughs> it's actually a lot easier for him to steal when he's in uh this mode. Goodbye. If he drops something else, dude. All right, we stole the item. It took like eight years, but now we have an iron broadsword that is actually worse. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> All right, we're moving on. It's a good thing you guys on YouTube didn't have to go through that. We are in the marshlands. Whoa, look at this hand. Oh, it's a shadow hand. Whoa, look at this ducky. Muddy hand. Night, night. Yeah, go to sleep, buddy. All right. Come on, man. We don't need no more muddy hands, bro. We don't need no more muddy hands. These muddy bastards. We're gonna dazzle the hell out of them. They all got dazzled. Perfect. So we're definitely gonna sizz to these guys. Let's heat things up. Bro, you still calling for backup? Yo! Stop! Uh, whoosh. Trent, welcome to the stream. Oh my god, you're still calling for backup? Is that all y'all do? That's all y'all do is jump people, huh? Good day. Go to sleep. Thank you. Alright, we can guarantee him and his death. Well, at least I can sell the iron broadsword and get it for money. That is true. Backup means more EXP. But these dudes be dragging out these fights on these on this harder difficulty. <laughs> Bye. Go to sleep, buddy. Don't ever wake up. 464. Can I get a... Well, fuck you then, too. <laughs> Gundula. Alright, let these dudes move a little bit. Ah, sorry, guy. I'm out. These muddy hands might cause a problem because they show up out of nowhere. Oh, it's a shiny guy. I guess this is how we get to the other areas. We can take his mount and we can probably fly. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna put you... Nice. I gotta use a file. I gotta use a... Damn, Veronica, you really wanna do this? Right here, right now? There we go. So now he can sleep. Yikes. That's not good. Splatty punk. Go to sleep, man. So we want to just attack this guy. May heaven's winds propel thee hence. 
If Veronica's goals before Eric will sap. Yup. We're gonna sap for a guaranteed kill on this guy. Uh, yeah! Go to sleep. Damn it. Well, let's hope this still kills. Alright, it did. So now we can ride his mount. Go to sleep, buddy. Wow, I go again? What is this nonsense? Alright, summons a citrus that sends the chance of your party casting critical spells through the roof. Alright. If I feel like we need to do that, I'll do that. Did I do alright? You did alright. What? No! No! That's not what I wanted! That's not what I wanted! <laughs> I wanted to ride the fucking vehicle! Not shoot a crossbow arrow! Please let me- Nah, if I try to run... If I try to run, that'll just suck. Because they can just call more people. Do- do nonsense. Alright. I did not want to shoot the crossbow. Like, the vehicle was right there, and I hit X, and it didn't happen. Oh my god. Um, we're just gonna... Nothing gonna sizz them, boys. Um... Let's go and try this one. Let's check this out. I love how he keeps his armor on, too. This is dope. Praise the sun. I'm going to... Whoosh. No crit. Yikes. I need 5 MP. Alright, he's still asleep. No crit. No crit on- no crit spell? I'm trying to get these crit spells, bro. Dude, look at all these single files. I got these because I was beating up. I was grinding off of the Yumo Goi Goi Feige Salt, the little zealot cloak, like, the cloak wearing dudes. The cloak wearing dudes. God damn, smack his ass. All right, my dude, persecutor. You still alive? Who else wants some? <laughs> All right. Okay, it didn't disappear like I was thinking it would. So we can go to these aisles, right? Yup. Thought so. Oh man, it would be in dark time, right? Seed of skill, hey! You know what? I'm gonna use that seed of skill immediately. And I'm gonna throw it on Soul. So now he has exactly enough to get what I want. The Metal Slash. Hopefully that counts for uh, armor wearing people too. A mysterious attack that hurts an enemy while healing the user. Oh nice, Miracle Slash. 
Sword Stance. Adopts a supple stance that can greatly increase the number of parries performed. Alright. Alright. Yeah, I haven't really been using Zoom to my advantage. I'm not gonna lie. But I will definitely keep that in mind now. No, you can't get me out here, bro. Nope, I'm out. I go up here? No, I cannot. I'm just trying to look for any items that I might be missing over here. I'm just trying to see if there's any crossbows. The shiny dude came back, I see. Alright, let's see. Let's just traverse on this guy. Let's make sure to try to keep him. Whoa, fuck you guys. I'm out of here. Wait a minute, did I come from here? Yeah, I did. So I almost just went in the... It just went in a circle, just about. Oh, I can't continue mounted? Oh! I'm sorry, Beetle. Is that a rat I can fight? I was about to say. Iron ore. Copper ore. Alright, gold ore. Nothing else here for us to shoot. Dude, look at this cow. Holy cow. Let's see what kind of weather we can look forward to. Ooh, looks like the sky should start to clear at dawn tomorrow. It'll be perfect weather for adventure. So grab the bull by the horns and get out of here. What? what the fuck, man? I don't understand these fucking cows. <laughs> no, I don't want to fight you. Oh, this place is sick. All right, apparently there's a chest over there. But the only way up is... Well, this is the only way to proceed. Eventually, there's probably a way to go down. Look at all these... Look at all these muddy hands. Leave me alone, bro. Nope. Fresh water. Nope. The only dude I want to fight is this guy. Boom, boom. All right. Wow. I didn't know you could do this. You can move the camera. When the, when the battle first begins, of course. Oh, God. Goddamn! My man with the second crit. I think this Flython actually might be considered a threat. Yeah, I'm doing a lot of damage to him with that move. We definitely want to whoosh. Uh, bang! This will most likely be the last fight we get into for now. I just needed to get the ride. Thank you for dying. Oh yeah. Nice. Nice level up, buddy. I feel better than ever. Oh, nice level up, chick. Zing. Zing zing zong. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Whoa, it's a fucking tiger. 
There's no bears though. Alright, I can just come out over here finally. Let's see what's out over here. Fairy fluff. Boom, boom, boom. Bruh. This is why I clipped through the game and ended up at the final trial of the game and I unlocked some of the most broken stuff. <laughs> this is how you break the game. You clip through the wall with this beetle and it brings you to the end of the map. It warps you around the world. You know, I'm pretty sure somebody's gonna find something dumb like that. Let's be real here, people. Uh-uh, no, 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 I'm wilding out. I hard armor. Hel iron helmets, cure ass, iron armor. I'm out! Jeez. I am out. I will mess with you tigers later. We made it to Gondolia. Gondolia. Welcome to Gondolia. Hey, we made it. We made it to a Gondolia entrance tunnel. Yay. Entrance tunnel. Let's go. Gondolian knuckles. <laughs> Do you know the way? We are in Gondolia town. We're making love. Ba -dum -ba -dum -ba. Making up lyrics. Let's go. That's what I do best. All right. We made it. Time to go look for recipes. Time to break pots. Time to get new quest. Mm, what a beautiful place. It feels as though the whole town is bobbing up and down on the waves. So this is Gondolia, huh? I heard there were some big scores to be had here. Rich merchants from all over the world, ships full of treasure, you name it. And this is where you're keeping your ship, Silvando. The ship that you own. Don't tell me you're some kind of millionaire. Oh, come now, Ronnie, darling. You know it's not polite to pry. All right. The docks are in the southwest of the town. Last one there's a rotten egg. Broader sword. It's not a broad sword. It's just a broader sword. <laughs> I feel like I could probably steal that from somebody. It's a really good looking weapon. Look at that. Attack goes up to 102. Steel lance. Posey pole. Alright, let's talk to this old man. Oh no, 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 no. I'm not reading your language. Welcome to your own town. <laughs> Welcome to our own town. Here you can buy the famous products from all over the whole world. You want to visit the dock? It's in the west part of the city. Maybe it's... Cat hat. We can get a cat hat. We can get a tanuki suit. Change the words, appearance. Is this better for what she has? Than what she has? Charm goes up. Yep, this is actually better than what she has, so... And I have just enough to buy it. Part of 
Safari the kitty cat. I just need the cat suit. Where the hell do I get that? I managed to get away from Heliodor for a bit. The whole dark spawn escaping thing has sent the place into a right old pan panic. Which is great for weapon cells, of course. I'm going to snap up a few bargains here and there to then take back home. We should be able to turn a tidy profit, really. Alright, here we go. Alright, we got a red book. What's we got here, man? Noah Art. Soul takes it from the shelf and has a closer look. Almost everyone, almost anyone who spent time among the less reputable. Why can't I read? Why can't I read? Why don't I know how to read? I quit. I don't know how to read. I can't read. I shouldn't. I don't. I don't deserve to play RPGs if I don't know how to read. Like, I, I quit. In fact, I think I should just jump off a bridge. All right, guys. This is the end of the playthrough. I'm sorry. <laughs> all right. I, I'm, all right. Let's get it. All right, from the name of the local barber's mistress to the deepest, darkest secret of the royal family. He knows every tidbit of tattle and every scrap of scandal in every single street corner in the land. But how does this mysterious figure come into possession of all these sensitive secrets? Many an intrepid investigator have tried to uncover his sources, but each and every one of them has failed. His sense for a scoop is the stuff of legend. Oh my god. Alright, here we go. Oh wait, what's around the corner? Wow, even, even whoa, look how higher we can go. Any books here? Wait, what's in the book? There's a picture called Somewhere Under the Rainbow. Really? Once upon a time, on a lovely summer's day, a rainbow appeared in the sky. As he yawned, a single tear fell out of the corner of his eye and the sparkling sunlit lit into the seven different colored lights from which little baby lampings lamplings were born the leafy lampling with his bright green cap of, of leaves <laughs> the luminous lampling with the brilliant blue flame copyright this is copyright they don't they don't know what they think we don't know what that is that's copyright my guy Square, Square Enix is about to get sued. Man, today's been a horrible day for me. Like, I, I just can't fucking read today, apparently. <laughs> and I apologize for not being able to read, guys. I'm gonna try harder. A little bit off. I got a single file. Y'all still giving me single files, man? This is this is gonna have a mini metal. How much y'all wanna bet? One of these pots is gonna have a mini metal. Okay, I lied. So was there another reason of coming up here? Oh look at that lady right there. Why is she looking up? I think it's actually better to just fall down. There's so many, t there's so many places to look in this freaking town, dude. I'm having fun. I'm just on, walking on freaking tight ropes, breaking into people's houses, breaking pots, reading books. You see the rope between the roofs? One year, little Benihol, ben he walked the whole way along. Isn't it incredible? I just did the same thing. He no do things like that anymore. Maybe he become the. Oh, this is his hometown. This is. This is definitely his hometown because they are talking just like Silvando. Hey, dude, they got a keg right here. 
As soon as you walk in the door, there's a freaking keg. Damn. They, they, they know how to throw parties. Alright, looks like we're going under. You hear about the tentac tentacular who... What? Tentacular who causes so much havoc around the harbor? Oh, it must be a boss. My husband, he tell me all about him. Like, I can read it in my head, but it's like trying to speak it consistently. It's hilarious. All right, what you got here? This has got to be a recipe. Why else am I down here? We must show the world the most wonderful example of ourselves that is possible. Show off what? Feisty. Ooh. Okay. I didn't learn anything from that other than they like to be manly men. What else is over here? Any books? All right, let's get out of here. We are exploring. We are having fun. We are going to find some more pots to break. Don't you worry. Oh, I can't break these pots? What the hell, man? There is no sparkly spots. All right, we've been upstairs. We've been in there. There's a locked area here. I assume downstairs? Yeah, we can't go that way. The door is locked tight. All right. The door won't budge. It seems somebody was actually smart enough to lock their door. For once. I guess they didn't want their pots being broken. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Hey, ma'am, do you have any information about your neighbor? Because I am trying to barge in their rooms and pretty much ravage through all their bookshelves, all their dressers, and all their pots for items. My husband is a sailor. He traveled all over Ordrea, so he often tell me about what happened in the faraway kingdoms. Yesterday, he told me about a prisoner who escaped from Heliodor. You say Sir Hendrik is looking for him. The pr this prisoner, he must be very dangerous. Moto Perscoloso. <laughs> uh. Okay. <laughs> uh, I totally understand. Yeah. I speak this language. Clearly. Hey, what else? Does this have the key? Oh, we got a mini metal. Hey. Mini medals can be traded in later in. If it's just like any other Dragon Quest game, these collectibles we can trade in to acquire some really neat items. I like the detail. Look at that. I'm exploring these areas. Some of it is actually worth exploring. Some of it is just not worth exploring, but that's just the part of exploring. Oops. Alright, let's go check across the street. Checking across the street for items. Hey, man, can I break up in here? Hey, y'all didn't lock y'all doors. Y'all didn't lock your doors. That's a problem. That's a big no no. Grazi. I have customers. Welcome to the item shop. Utility belt. A belt beloved by builders and often tradesmen that boost defense. Utility. Why would I buy a utility belt? What's the point of buying this? It does nothing for me. Maybe if they gave me deafness. Oh, yeah. If we want to be able to steal constantly, we want to get this. I might be able to steal that from somebody, though. Also, we can sell that iron broadsword that we got. Only for 250, bro. Cortiva Education, New Jersey. I don't know anyone in New Jersey. Hello? Oh, really? 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 Hey, hey, I have Ligma, so I don't think that'll be actually good for me. Ligma boss, ha ha! <laughs> oh my god 
fuck? Like, why am I getting these calls? Stop calling me! Stop calling here! Alright. Hashtag Ligma. Yep, I'll give you the history. She go boom. If there is no doge rung tondo, I cannot make the living with my ba. I owe him everything. We're in Spain. We're in Spain, everybody. Orlando Bloom is here. Orlando Bloom. Antonio. Antonio Banderas. <laughs> There's a gondola that right there. Look at these guys. Salute, my name is Satori, and I am the organizer of Signor Universal. In this moment, I make the final adjustments to the schedule. This year's competition is biggest ever, Moto Grande. It is all because of the hard work of Doge Rotondo. He is the hero of Gondolia. Gondolia. Santo Cielo, it's already time for Signor Universal. I feel it's only yesterday when Hercules won last year's competition. Competition. Your mockery to our language. How dare. Oh, is that a Puff Puff girl? I know a Puff Puff girl when I see a Puff Puff girl. Hey, girl, let me get that Puff Puff. Don't you, you in the shady spot? You know you're going to give me this Puff Puff. Do I please thee, good sire? Am I in Fahrenheit eyes that may have. Yeah, let me get that Puff Puff. Puff Puff, Puff Puff Puff. Yeah. Yeah, girl. So anyway, I'm not trying to be perverted or sound perverted. I'm just trying to be entertaining. But anyway, fuck those barrels. And also, basically, the reason why I search out for those Puff Puff girls is because it's a trophy related to getting Puff Puff from Puff Puff girls all around the Puff Puff world. I'm legit being serious. What the? Pare Revere. What is that? I put it in the bag, right? Um. Doo -doo -doo. Doo -doo -doo. Fairy stuff. Fairy fluff. Equipment bag. Chance of prevent. Oh, chance of being prevented from casting spells. Chance of being. All right, that's not bad, I guess. Spell selling abilities. So, 25%. We want to raise that up just to be able to... Look at this drop. I lost my job, and you know who is to blame? The Dark Spawn Piccolo. What? The Dark Spawn Piccolo? Is he no escape from Heliodor. No monster, no come. Oh my god. Don't blame it on Piccolo, because... Goku wasn't here to save you. Fuck these barrels. Alright, what else can we find? Hey, we fishing? Can I fish? Seed of strength. Thank you. Sun bleached sea cell. Seashells, seashells by the seashore. Alright, here we go. It was an automated message. Alright, you're not telling me anything useful, old man. Alright, look at the stalls. We have no money, by the way. I need to hit up a bank. Definitely, probably need to hit up a bank, shouldn't I? Alright, I think we've pretty much been everywhere except for the church and some other areas. We yeah, haven't been over here. Look at this guy. Prego, prego. You want a pretty cat suit? It's very cheap. Wouldn't cat suit 10,000 gold? Oh my god. 
Oh my god. So you want 10,000? Bro, you want 10,000 for a silly ass costume that will probably get outdated by future equipment. As cool as it would be to actually have some kind of like equipment slot or a tiger slot, that would be cool. Difficult to choose. I don't even have that money right now. What? What the? What? Why are they all selling these? No, man. This is wild. What if I go back? Can I get it down? I wonder if I can go back to the other guy and, you know, bring the price down <laughs> even more. Can you believe it? This mean, mean man won't let us into the docks. It's nothing personal. The docks are off limits for everybody now. It's because of la competizione. Great. So I guess we just have to sit tight till this contest thing is over, huh? See, si, is the only choice. I am sorry, but Senor Universo is molto, molto importante event for people of Gondolia. Senor oh. Universo, you say? Now that sounds like fun. Tell me more, honey. I'm all ears. Naturalmente. Senor Universo is for men of all ages. The winner, he must be a powerful like the waves, graceful like the breeze, and deep like the sea. All I hear is mini game time. I'm in. La competizione is reason why Gondolia is so filled with the strong and admirable men in this moment. Ooh, I love a little pageantry. Come on, darlings, let's go see what it's all about. We can sample some local delicacies to get ourselves in the mood. I hear they're to die for. Well, who's with me? Come on, you know you want to. I'm not that bothered about whatever silly contest they're having, but I am quite peckish. I'd love to try a few local treats. Seriously? We're not here on holiday, you know. We're supposed to be looking for the rainbow. Right, Serena? Ring bow, 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 bow. <laughs> mm, well. Well, what? Um, I'm so sorry, but I'm really rather hungry <laughs> myself. And, Same. Well, we can't leave until the contest's over anyway, so. <laughs> mm -hmm. I don't believe this. Well, looks like we got beat three to two. Hey, right. listen, we're kind of in a hurry here, and we really need to get to the dock. Do you know who's in charge of this contest? Naturalmente. The person in the charge is Dojo Rotondo. He is in the charge of everything in our town. His villa is in the northeast part of Gondolia. You must speak with him. He is so much a kind man. Molto gentile. You heard the man. Let's go ask this Doge guy to let us into the docks. All right, Doge. Doge. We still ain't been in a church. Anything I can find over here? I can't get further down. The only way to get further down is to do that. So. Um, we need to get downstairs. We need to get into this church. Here we go. That's not the church! Oh, wow, it's a nun. Sweet. Is this a book, too? 
Yeah. Filigree for fun and profit. He takes a look inside. Finds how to make gold platters, gold chains, gold bracers, two chains. We know how to make two chains. Sweet. Literally, gold chains, my guy. All we were sheep shall find a welcome in this house. Yeah, it's been a while since we saved it, to my knowledge. So I think we would want to save our game. Gondola ride over? Yeah, let's go on a gondola. Gondola. Is there anything the gondola is supposed to give me access to? I am on a gondola. I am working a gondola. Is there anything in this other gondola? Anything specifically I'm supposed to be looking for? I don't think I can really do anything with this gondola right now. Wait, was that a golden sparkle? No, no chest. We just exploring, man. That's all we we're really doing. I, I didn't. I don't see anything specific. Yeah, she she in the corner giving puff puffs. Like puff puffs are looked down in this world too, man. It's messed up. He sings so beautifully. His soothe song. Yes, he is no no the only contestant who still my heart. Oh, yes, so. But I think you know nothing of it. That should be easy. We, we need to find whoever we need to find. Okay, I picked the right one this time. This Let's must go. be the place. Let's see if he's home. We found it. Knock, knock, his knuckles. Oh, no, me, no, I am coming. Uh, hey, we're looking for the Doge. The Doge. We need to ask him a favor. The Doge Meister. Bene, I am Doge Rotondo. Always I am happy to help. Doge Rotondo. I have nothing to say to you. Niente. Now you must go. Andate via. Bruh, how you gonna slam the door in my hey, face like wait. that? I'm the luminary of the stars, fam. Don't make me break down this door and beat your ass. I don't care if you go get so retondo. Much for Malto Gentile. I've met kinder judges. He took one look at you and freaked out, huh? Wait, you don't think... Nah, how would he know you were on the run? Come on, man. And why just you? I want him to feel the pain. Of these inferior being wait wrong game i want him to get his ass beat how dare he close the door in my face i don't settle problems with words i settle problems uh, with fists the cuffs veronica's managed to get herself into a bit of a scrape please you have to come and help oh my god veronica's always talking shit. <sighs> man you can't take that kid anywhere <laughs> still i guess we won't be sailing out of here anytime soon might as well go see what's up. See what's up. Give it back, you dirty, rotten thief! It's not like you can use it anyway. A kid like you wouldn't have the first idea what to do with a wand. Why no? You are the kid, just like me. Anyway, I only borrow, no steal. What's going on here, Serena? We were just walking along when he came out of nowhere and snatched her wand. We caught up with him here, but he won't give it back. Oh. Tell him 
He'll set himself on fire with that thing. Hey! You just tuck it back easily. That's how you do it. Just take that shit back. Here. Don't let it get swiped so easily next time. Big bro Eric had to step in. But why did you even want my wand in the first place? It's not worth much money, you know. I, uh... Hmm? I like you, so I did this devious thing to you. What is it, kid? Spit it out. Uh, 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 uh. Nani? It's okay, Placido. I explain the situation. My name is Benigno. He is my friend, Placido. He's the only son of the Doge Rotondo. Every day we are playing together. Molto felice. Happy, happy. But then Placido, he loses his voice. I don't understand what happened. I ask, but he cannot answer. A witch stole his voice, and now we gotta go find the witch, beat the voice out of the witch, and uh, we solve the situation. So I think, if I have the magic, maybe I can fix Placido's voice. Capisce? My dude is trying to get him out of that status element. <laughs> Hmm. Fine, you're forgiven. Now, tell me more about your friend's lost voice. It's his throat. There's some sort of awful... Oh, he's been cursed, poor thing. My boy, it's time for you to go to the church. <laughs> I might be able to help him if I had some birdsong nectar. But I'd need some water from a sacred fountain to make it, and, well... <gasps> you needed a special, very, very holy water to help Placido, see? I hear people talking about something like this. The river, west of Gondolia. If you follow it up, there is a cave. The Grotta della Fonte. Everybody say its water is molto speciale. So if we help the kid of the very important guy we needed to talk to we'll probably get him to help us i know i still have the wand and i know this is very bad but per favore you must help placido we are friends since we are the small children bambini piccoli and now you are mamma his only hope. you will help him see mamma si? mia luigi mario grazie mille signore you bring her the water from the grotta and make the special nectar. And I will stay to take care of Placido. Placido. Placenta. Wait, what? Is his name Placenta? Whoa, look at this beast guy. Do not come near. You will destroy me. You will destroy us all. Be gone with you. Oh, no. Some people know that I'm uh, the luminary or a.k.a. I'm the uh, the evil guy that ran away from Heliodor. That man, they say he come from Z Zwarch Rust? What the hell? Zwarz? Swartz fart? <laughs> but the city is totally destroyed now. Why is Dragon Quest 11 or Dragon Quest games always be having cities being destroyed? It's messed up, bro. That's just a canon thing to expect. He no have a home to return to. Northeast of here, across the ocean, but there's only the pile of rubble now. Damn. Alright, so I think what we're gonna do, we're gonna go solve this problem. But before we solve this problem, we're gonna go all the way to church, and we're gonna pray. We're gonna go to church, we're gonna pray, we're gonna save our game, and once we come back from praying, we're gonna do some spraying in the grotto. So I'll see you guys soon.